With OpenKM multi-company, we refer to the capacity of offering a document management system from one shared request from the application, which means that several companies can use the program, the main benefit of using multi-company being profitability, saving on additional software and hardware costs and all its maintenance. As we can see, we are logged in as the administrator. On the upper right center part of the screen, we have a drop-down menu. And that permits us to change companies. We see here categories defined for each company. We have here a template where we change company. We can see here that we have other folders and files, other defined categories that are not the same as before, and other template. We then continue changing to company 2, and we'll observe that we have a different list of folders, documents, and also available is a different list of categories. If we go to administration, we can see all the defined users for the different companies, and we can see that because we are logged in as the super administrator. We exit the application and we are going to log in as company one user. We can see that we only have Company 1 folders and documents. On the upper right center part of the screen, there is no longer the option to change companies. We can add a category. We only have available the categories that have been defined in the context for that company. Here we have the results. Here we see the names of the documents, we'll do a search, we'll search for all the text files. And it will automatically give the results only for that company. We can see here that the users are also limited only to that company to the users that are available from that company. Now we are going to log in as a user from company 2. As we can observe, this user only has access to the files and folders of his own company, Company 2. We can add a category from a category only accessible from Company 2. We see here the categories available to Company 2. Only documents from Company 2 appear. We can do a search to see all the documents in text that are available and only the documents available to Company 2 will appear. And here we can see the users that correspond to that company.